I'm going to show you quickly how you can create 3D text in Adobe Illustrator and then bring them over into Canva for your designs. First, let's go ahead and type out some text. Let's make it larger. Then I want to change the color of this. Um, Let's make it be that green and I also want to give it a stroke. Okay, good. Now let's go up to window and select 3D and materials. Then select inflate. You want to set the depth to about 60. And you want to set the volume of this um, to about 35. Now, to show you what these two settings do, if you look at it from the top or from the side, you can start to see that it gives depth to the text and it also um, makes the front part, so let me show you the front look like this you know nice and smooth um so the next thing we want to do after that is we want to inflate both sides and then come all the way down to here and for this one i'm going to leave the position here i'm going to go over now to materials scroll down and set roughness to zero then over to lighting, I'm going to increase the intensity to about 125. That looks good. I'm going to increase the softness as well to about 72. And I'm going to come down here before I touch anything else and turn on shadows. So this is what my shadow looks like. I want the shadow bounds to be at 400% so I can get the entire shadow. And then I want it to be below my object. So now I can come back up here and I can rotate my shadow like that. And that's my first 3D object. Now you can also duplicate. So I can hold on to Alt and drag this down here. So it creates a second 3D object. And I can come in and change the text of this. So let me call this uh, text, since that's what we're doing. Where's my T? Didn't I add a T to this? <laughs> ah, perfect. So let me move this one up a bit and bring, come on. Oh, by the way, this, this uses up a lot of your PC's power, so just be patient with it. So I have 3D up here. I'm going to put this one flat on the floor to show you two different perspectives. So I'm going to come back to um, Object, and I want to have the preset set to Isometric Top, like this. And then I want the shadow, so we'll go back to Lighting. I want the shadow to be behind my object now and then I can change the rotation to make it go like that to match what we have up on the top. The next thing I want to do is to change the color of this one. I want to make it um, a pinkish color like that and the oh, okay and the, um, the stroke I also want to make a lighter shade like that so now that we have this um, I can select both of them Oop, close this oh no wait I have to do that one but so I, I select each of them then I go over here and render it so that's my 3d rendered and then I can come here and render my text Perfect. Now I can just go to File, Export, Export for Screens, 
and export this as a PNG. Open Canva and drag my text over. Now I can bring this into my artwork just like that and I can add a background. Let's just add a solid color background for now. Send this to the back and then you can adjust the color to whatever you want. And that is how you can easily create 3D text. You can also try out these nice gradients that they have. Oh, that looks good. So you create it in Adobe Illustrator and you can bring it over into Canva and use as an element into any artwork that you have.